This is Calabrios. You know, former Mali Pacquiao victim Brandon Rios. You know, he believes that Chris Algieri has the boxing skills, reach, and height to defeat Pacquiao in their fight on November 22nd in China. Now, Rios says he sparred Algieri twice in Oxnard, California, and he fought him to be an outstanding boxer with excellent skills. Now, Rios wasn't awed by Algieri's power, but he says that his reach and movement made him a really tough fighter to deal with. Now, Pacquiao's been fortunate lately with the matchmaking done by him. He's not really been putting guys that are a lot taller than him. So, obviously, he sees no accident. You know, even though, you know, when he was matched against the two guys, uh, you know, he's past Oscar De La Hoya and Antonio Margarita, you know, both of them were uh, so weak-trained that they were uh, too weak to put up a fight. Now, for this fight on November 22nd, Algeria will get the benefit of a catchweight with the fight taking place at 144, and Algeria fights at 140, so he'll be better off for this fight than he normally is, is. Now, well, you know, Algeria's a great boxer. He don't have the power, but he's a great boxer, said Rios. You know, I've worked with him both times. That's why I told him that he would beat Pervonikov and outbox him. And Algeria has to reach if he stays on the outside. You know, Algeria will do great. He will do great. Now, Rios, you know, he's correct about Jerry having the reach and boxing skills. He gave the 35-year-old Pacquiao, you know, a really good fight here. But, you know, as long as the fight to Jerry he keeps the action on the outside, he's going to have a huge advantage against the tiny Mr. 5-6 Pacquiao. Now, Al Jerry's good at using his height and reach as benefit. He's not one of the fighters like uh, Margarita who gives up his height by standing a foot away from his opponents. You know, Al Jerry believes in keeping the action on the outside, so he can use his powerful jab and his long reach. Now well, let's hear for Pacquiao. Would room his dreams of getting a fight against Mr. Uh, you know, Dane Garcia and uh, Sal Canelo Alvarez. You know, the door Mayweather fight would likely be officially closed for good. And, uh, you know, it's uh, possible that Garcia and Cornell might still fight Pacquiao at a later date after he redeems himself. But you could pretty much forget about them fighting any, anytime soon if you would uh, have a bad time fighting the Algeria.